ಶ್ರೀ ಗಣಪತಿ ಶಾರದ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿತಂ ರಘುನಾಥ ಶತಕೋಟಿ ಪ್ರವಿಸ್ತರಂ ಏಕೈಕಮಕ್ಷರಂ ಪುಂಸಾ ಮಹಾಪಾತಕ ನಾಶನ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೆಷನ್ ಆನ್ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಚರಿತ ಮಾನಸ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಸ್ವೀಸಾ ರಾಮ ಅಂಡ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಅಕಂಪನಿಂಗ್ ವಿಶ್ವಾಮಿತ್ರ ವರ್ ಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ಟುವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಮಿಥಿಲ ವೈಲ್ ಆನ್ ದ ವೇ ಇ ಕೇಮ್ ಟು ಗೌತಮಾಶ್ರಮ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಾ ಅಹಲ್ಯ ಹೂ ವಾಸ್ ಕರ್ಸ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ಗೌತಮ ಲೈಯಿಂಗ್ ದೇರ್ ಆಸ್ ಎ ಹ್ಯೂಜ್ ರಾಕ್ and with the touch of the shri rama's cup feet he immediately ahalya immediately came back to the life and she praised shri rama and then she joined with her husband with her consort shej gautama shri rama and lakshmana accompanied the siege and they continued the journey towards mithila and reached the bank of the ganga the stream of which purifies the whole universe the son of gadi vishwamitra related the whole legend how the celestial stream had come down upon earth the lord then performed his ablutions with all the sages and the brahmanas received gifts of various kinds accompanied by a troop of hermits the lord gladly proceeded further and quickly drew near to the capital of the videhas mithila when shri rama beheld the beauty of the city he was he as well as his younger brother were much delighted there were many big and small wells rivers and tanks with water as sweet as nectar and reached by flights of steps made of jewels bees bees drunk with honey made a sweet humming sound and birds of various hues soft softly coo lotuses of different colors opened their petals while a cool soft and fragrant breeze ever delighted the soul The city was adorned on all sides with flower gardens orchards and groves a haunt of innumerable birds full of blossoms fruit and charming leaves the beauty of the city surpassed description every inch of it was so captivating there was a lovely bazaar and gorgeous balconies made of jewels fashioned as it were by the creator with his own hands wealthy and good merchants who vied with kubera the god of wealth sat with all their various goods beautiful crossings of roads and charming streets were constantly sprinkled with scented waters the houses of all were abodes of bliss and contained beautiful wall paintings portrayed as it were by rati's lord cupid himself the people of the city both men and women were good looking pious saintly virtuous wise and accomplished the palace of king janaka was most marvelous the sight of whose splendor astounded even gods even the fortification wall filled the mind with wonder it seemed as if it had enclosed within its limits the beauty of the whole universe white palaces were screened here and there by bejeweled gold tapestries of various beautiful designs while the exquisite palace where sita lived was far too lovely for words to describe the entrances to the palace were all beautiful and hard like thunderbolt or made of diamond they were always strong with feudatory princes dancers panegyrists and bards there were spacious stables and stalls for elephants which were crowded at all times with steeds elephants and chariots 
the king had number of brave ministers and generals they all owned mansions that vied with the royal palace in the outskirts of the city by the side of the lakes the rivers numerous princes had encamped here and there on seeing a fine mango grove which was comfortable and agreeable in every way the sage kaushika or vishwamitra said o wise hero of raghu's race i like this orchard let us stay here then very well lord very well my lord answer the gracious lord and encamped there with all the hermit strain when the king of mithila got the news that the great sage vishwamitra had come he took with him his faithful ministers a number of warriors noble brahmanas his family preceptor satananda and the chief of his kinsmen and thus went forth rejoicing to meet the foremost among sages placing his head on the sage feet the king made obeisance to him while the lord of the sages vishwamitra gladly gave him his blessing the king then respectfully saluted the brahmanas and congratulated himself on his good fortune on being able to receive them inquiring again and again about his welfare Vishwamitra led the king to a seat thus Janaka well received Vishwamitra in his city of Mithila for his unexpected arrival into the great yaga of the dhanu namaste sharada devi lakshmira puravasini tvamaham prarthaye nityam vidya dananch dehi me bye श्रीरामचंद्र कृपाल भजमन हरण भव भय दारुण श्रीरामचंद्र कृपाल भजमन हरण भव भय दारुण श्रीरा श्रीरा Shri Ram